Second area I wanted to talk about was our roadmap, volume two of our roadmap. The roadmap began in 2014. We pulled together five goal teams of over 100 faculty, students, staff, and alums, and they generated, generated recommendations for us around four key goals. Uh, one was the relentless pursuit of research and creative excellence. One was improving uh, uh, diversity and inclusion throughout the college. One was building a deeper culture of public engagement. And one was ensuring that our students were uh, ready to hit the round, ground running at the highest level upon graduation for their careers and for their, uh, and for their life. In these areas, together we were talking about being a destination, these were helping us to think about being a destination college, the kind of place that we would be on the short list of students, faculty, staff, and partners, community partners from around the country who would want to work with us because of the high quality of what we, what we do. Over the course of this past summer, we did some refreshing of the roadmap that we're calling, uh, calling Volume 2 to out outline a series of next steps uh, to further implement these goals. And let me give you some examples of uh, the kind of things that we're trying to, uh, trying to do. First, we are re-emphasizing this idea of being a destination college. And that our goal in becoming a destination college is not just to make us feel good about ourselves, but our goal in being a destination college is, and I'm sorry if it sounds corny, but that's how we help make the world a better place. It's through this work that we do. It's through having great graduates, undergraduate students and graduate students. It's through great research and creative work. It's through high level engagement. That's what starts to change lives of our students here, but also beyond the campus as well. And ultimately, that's, that's our goal. I mean, that's why, that's why we do what we do. So we we'll want to make sure that that's very clear as we're talking about the roadmap, that that is a driving principle of the roadmap. As I said, we've, we're expanding and uh, further developing some of the things that we've already done on the roadmap. So in the area of readiness, for example, we are implementing a comprehensive internship strategy for the uh, college, which been, has been worked on over the past year or so. And we're uh, launching that, have started to launch it already, and we'll further uh, launch that particular strategy. We're also providing new support for graduate students who are considering careers outside of academia. In the area of research excellence, we are working to increase small grant funding and to increase and regularize summer funding for graduate students. We know it's important from a humane living perspective, and it's also important from a recruitment perspective as well. These are just some examples um, uh, that we're working on. In engagement, we will be aiming to develop courses for faculty and grad students who are interested in being public scholars and being more uh, in the role of a public intellectual, really helping people develop that particular skill set. And we will be working to launch the Humanities Engagement Hub as well. And then in the area of diversity, we will be formalizing a diversity initiative uh, for the college, and we will be creating a dedicated leadership position uh, for diversity, equity, and inclusion. So those are some examples of the kind of things we're working on. Uh, we will be releasing in fairly short order the volume two document, so you can see some of the other um, plans that we will be working on over the next three years. <clears throat> 